Hi, I'm Mike Becker, Executive Director of Tickets, the Reading Fight and Fills. The 2017 season is just around the corner. Pitchers and catchers are reporting to spring training, and individual game tickets are now on sale for all 2017 Fight and Fills home games. It's an exciting time of year. I'm just as excited to introduce you to our 2017 Fight and Fills ticket office staff, the people here to help you out with all your questions and ticket purchases. Without further ado, here's the best ticket office staff in all of baseball. Hi, my name is John Nally. Hi, my name is Derek Lupia. Hi, I'm Brian Wells. My name is Casey Lagan. Hi, my name is Nick Ondo. I'm Scott Rupp. Hi, my name is Jen Spearley. I'm the director of group sales with the Reading Flight and Fills. This is my seventh season overall, and it is my fourth full time. I started out as an intern in 2011. I'm a group sales manager here at the Reading Flight and Fills. I've uh, worked here for four years, and I started as an intern. I went to Lycoming College in Williamsport, Pennsylvania. Group sales manager here at the Fightins. Uh, this is my second year with the front office, but my first year full time. I went to Mount St. Mary's University, the Mount, the number one ranked team in the Northeastern Conference. I'm a second year intern in the ticket office and customer service representative during the games. Um, and I went to Kutztown University. I'm a group sales intern. Um, I'm a recent graduate from Kutztown University. I'm a group sales intern here at First Energy Stadium. Currently a senior at York College of Pennsylvania completing my internship to graduate this May. I'm a group sales intern here at the Reading Fight and Fills. Um, I graduated from Shippensburg University in May of 2016. An interesting fact about me is that I am an ambidextrous golfer. I golf both left-handed and right-handed. I am neither good uh, either way, but I do try. I'm an elected official out of Muhlenberg Township. I'm a commissioner. Um, I just try to do good by the people of Muhlenberg and uh, try to improve my local community. I once tried every single flavor on the Dairy Queen menu and I'm just uh, waiting for someone to tell me that that's impressive. I don't eat or drink anything that's purple. In college I was on the rugby team. I didn't play but I was on the team. Made a lot of great memories and a lot of great friends. And had some really cool gear. I think I drink the most coffee in the office. I'm at uh, four or five cups a day. I don't know how to drive but I do have a license. When I was 16 I threw a, a perfect game in, in the summer league, so it's a, something that I, I kind of hold on to and, and enjoy reflecting on. I have gotten lost in a public place three times this week. It is like my dream to one day meet Cole and Heidi Hamels and to like have dinner with them and just basically like enjoy their company because I've been obsessed with Cole since he got on the Phillies and when he was traded I cried. <laughs> I am currently a free agent in the NBA just waiting for that call. The promotion I'm most looking forward to is the Crazy Hot Dog Vendor's birthday party on Sunday, May 21st, which will include a Crazy Hot Dog Vendor baseball presented by Box Potato Chips. The appearance by SpongeBob SquarePants um, on Wednesday, August the 16th. Um, I think Patrick's going to be there as well. Pretty excited about that. The one night that I'm really looking forward to this year is one of our Mega Blasts. On Saturday, August 5th, we're doing a Harry Potter night. I'm a big Harry Potter fan, so I'm really looking forward to it. So make sure you give me a call if you want to buy tickets for the game, or if you want to talk about your favorite Harry Potter book, or your favorite Harry Potter book to movie combo, or just your favorite movie in general. Do not call me if you don't know that Neville Longbottom is the man. The promo I think most people are going to be excited about is Gluttony Night, because I'm who doesn't like all you can eat for nine dollars? Beer fest nights. We're gonna have six of them this year. Um, we're gonna have beer tasting for uh, two hours. Our scout sleepover night. It's June 23rd. Something we're doing where we're we're having scouts come out, sleep out on the field, enjoy a movie. It's gonna be memorable and, and real fun for them. Our morning game promotion uh, with the whoopie pies and being called the Reading Whoopies. Um, when I was a kid, my nana bought me whoopie pies all the time and I really think the fans are going to love them. I think it's a great um, promotion that's going to be out. And kegs and eggs too. That's always a great one. Opening night is Thursday, April the 13th. The first 3,000 adults receive an America's Classic Ballpark long sleeve t-shirt. See you in Baseball Town!